Morning all. So um, today's FL run is sponsored by Starbucks. Um, we're Costa. off to do, um, I know it's Costa, but it's not funny if I say Costa, is it? It's funny if I say Starbucks, because they can all see it's a Costa mug. Yeah. James is trying to edit my um, my humour. Anyway, back to <laughs> Ethel's. We're going to go do Shutlings Low. We're just on the outskirts of Macclesfield here. Uh, we're going to run through Mac Forest. Head up to Shutlings Low. I believe this is Ethel number 18. Um, we've only got one Ethel to do today. Uh, it seems a bit weak, but uh, it's a 10k run. So that means I've done 20k this week. My, my mileage is certainly um, not up to what it was last year. But anyway, see you on the trails. So it's stunning here at Mac Forest. It's one of the reservoirs. So we're running at the far side of the reservoir, across there. And we're going to go up through the woods all the way kind of up to there, somewhere up there, top of Shutlins Low. It's about 505 meters. Uh, and then we're going to come down through the woods at the other side and we'll come back down this road. So, amateur running tip number one don't drink a big cup of coffee before you go for a run because you'll be stopping within the first five minutes for a pee. <laughs> and it doesn't work for your pace. But anyway. There you go. Nice easy track to start with. Legs just down there, up through the woods. Get the old legs worked into it. Unlike on Monday when we were going straight uphill, that was still a killer. Still haunts me. Anyway, here we go. Jeez, whose bloody stupid idea was it to go up this way? Oh my word. Fear of repeating myself, kids. These uphill bits really don't get any easier. James has got no idea where he's going. He's going to end up in Congo at this rate. <laughs> right. Let's keep going. Onwards and upwards. You might have guessed. What an uphill bit. How firm. Navigating by memory today. So I know Mac Forest quite well. I used to rock groups up here at night time believe it or not doing night walks so I've probably done this hill more times in the dark than I have done in the light but anyway the path I was on I was hoping would come out at the top of this bit we're on now but it didn't it came out of the bottom so but there's one thing I've learned with this trail running is that the uphill bits are really tough and I mean some of them are tough you're absolutely blowing but keep going keep putting one foot in front of the other and that run down and then when you get to the top it's amazing because you really know that you've achieved something because if you got it added on a plate and it was super easy what have you actually achieved not much in my book but when you're putting the effort in and you know your body's hurting and your legs are aching it's worth it so that's tip number two keep going one foot in front of the other oh i think there's a lesser spotted um James there, we can hear up in the trees. Oh, about a mile ahead on the track. That's not too far. He's up there. See, it must be getting warm and steep because he's taken his, his first layer off. <laughs> Let's keep going. On the top hill bit now. Let's go. There she is. There's the top. Shuttling's low. It's actually quite steady along this top, but it's just a killer on the old cars. I told James we shouldn't do legs yesterday at the gym. Now we're paying for it. It's his fault, your fault. Um, so anyway, see you at the top folks. And always make sure you close the gate properly. What have you? Well, I forgot to take the video at the top of Shutlings Low, so here we are, top of Shutlings Low. Shutland Gate. Oh, nice flat bit now. When we get out from beyond here, that's my amazing muse. Of Manchester, 
Manchester or maybe not Manchester but Macclesfield <laughs> Manchester just beyond that hill there finally some downhill <laughs> One day, I'm going to fall, videoing this, doing this downhill bit. I'm going to go head, head over heels. Camera's going to go flying, and I'm going to send it into Jeremy Beadle. Oh, is it Harry Hill now? And who's got framed? Harry, who's being framed? On the home straight now, all downhill. He says, I have to have just a tiny little bit of uphill again. But one foot in front of Tuva and we keep going okay. what a beautiful day well 10k done on a Friday 10k done on a Monday gonna be a defo owed a few beers tonight and tomorrow for sure so that was number 17 of the old Ethels for 2022 Shotlands low, I believe it's about 505 meters above sea level. Um, sorry, you got the sun in your eyes there. How nice is that? Oh, no, oh there we go. Um, I'll post the route afterwards. I'll also post the Ethel. Um, it's beautiful here. If you if you're in this area uh, around Manchester, Matt Forest, North Staffordshire. And you should definitely come check out Shutlands Low. It's a good walk with the kids as well. Um, nice forest land. Um, toilets at the back at the forest rangers place. So it's good. Good parking as well. Free parking or you can pay to in the car park. Um, but anyway, so from me and James, who's somewhere down there. Um, thank you very much for joining us today. Check out the socials, Instagram, Facebook page. Who's Matt Wall? Uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe. Um, I think I'm on 14 subscribers. Let's see if we can get to 20, eh? After I've posted this video on my last one. We get to 20 subscribers, eh? Anyway, once again, thanks for joining me on my beardy runs. You guys take care, stay safe. One foot in front of Tuber, eh? Cheerio. Correction. It was Ethel number 18 today. Number 18, I'm cutting myself short by one. There you go.